hello everyone welcome to engineer this question here was asked in 2081 10 19 song periodical exam that is seventh level so the question says design concrete line irrigation canal to carry a discharge of 45 cumex that is it is given as 45 meter cube per second is discharge right and then the bed slope of the canal is s is given as 1 by 3000 and side slope is 2 is to 1 and Manning's coefficient n is given as 0 0.015 so let's see so generally when we uh, visualize the section we visualize like this but if we uh, build a line canal in this way there will be the possibility of uh, silting in this this part in this corners in this corner in this corner so generally we do not <coughs> prefer this type of this type of uh, section so this is converted to these type of sections so we prefer this uh, this type of triangular section or this type of trapezoidal section <coughs> okay so <coughs> talking about this type of uh, sections so one is to <coughs> this is z is to one is the uh, side slope given and uh, if this is theta and this is theta this is this will be two theta <coughs> now if you see here if you calculate from here you will get area equals to y square theta plus cot theta and p equals to 2y theta plus cot theta if you do calculation r is equal to a by p this and this will cancel and 1y and here 1y will be cancelled and uh, y by 2 will be the hydraulic mean depth or hydraulic radius right in case of triangular section so basically <coughs> you can <coughs> you can just calculate what we are not doing heat here you can just calculate from the geometry <coughs> and trigonometry now <coughs> trapezoidal for the tra trapezoidal channel section a will be equal to b this is b right b into y this will be b into y this is b into y now again y in y square theta right so he this area <coughs> this area will be y square <coughs> 1 by 2 y square theta this will be 1 1 by 2 y square theta so 1 by 2 y square theta plus 1 by 2 y square theta will be y square theta and the last one is this will be 1 by 2 y cot theta y square cot theta this area will be 1 square 1 by 2 y square cot theta and this will be 1 by 2 y square cot theta when summed it will be y square cot theta <coughs> right <coughs> so this will be the area for the p it will be this b weighted perimeter this will be the b and then this one is y theta and here it is y theta and here it will be y cot theta here it will be y cot theta so total will be b plus y theta plus y theta 2y theta and this and this 2y cot theta so if we find r equals to a by b this will be the result so generally for uh, q less than 55 umx we adapt triangular section so for this right for the uh, q less than 55 umx for the higher discharge we prefer trapezoidal section <coughs> so the question asked was uh, in the question was 45 cumex right so it is less than 55 so we can prefer triangular section right <coughs> triangular section so now cot uh, side slope is given as 2 is to 1 that will be cot theta is equal to 2 it will be cot theta is equal to 2 cot theta is equal to z is to z horizontal 1 vertical so this z will be the cot theta <coughs> so to calculate the theta we need to <coughs> calculate in calculator and that will be then uh, there is no cot theta directly written in calculator so we will convert it into then theta and inverse theta and then calculate 
and don't forget to <coughs> put the calculator in radian otherwise the answer will be given in degree and that will be the wrong answer <coughs> so theta is, is equal to 0 0.4636 radian this will be in radian <coughs> now we know a cos 2 y square theta plus cot theta previously done right here here <coughs> and it will be theta is 0 0.4636 and cot theta equals to 2 so it will be 2.4636 y, y square right so we are just taking 2.46 and p is equal to 2y theta plus cot theta here you can see right <coughs> now <coughs> sorry r is equal to a by b a by b right so r is equal to y by 2 you can see here r is equal to y by 2 now we know from manning's formula we have b equals to 1 by n r to r to the power 2 by 3 and s to the power 1 by 2 now v equals to what q by a right so this is q and this is a this one here you can see this a right and equals to 1 by 0 0.015 this is n and this is r equal r equals to 1 by y by 2 right so this is y by 2 and s equals to 1 by 3000 if you solve this into calculator put this into calculator and solve the answer will be y equals to 3.285 meter and we need so if you see in this figure this part this part is the free board right this part is the free board and you can take free board as 1 meter so total depth will be 4.285 meter so y equals to total y equals to 4.285 meter total right this is <coughs> up to the free board and if we consider free board this will be 4.285 okay that's all for now thank you for watching